A local support group advocating for mothers and babies is launching a new campaign. Black Baby Loss Awareness Week starts tomorrow. News 8's Amisha Ramsey is live downtown with this story. Amisha, tell us about the mission of the group Shades of Becoming a Mom. Well, good morning, Hannah. A childbirth for most women, they would like to carry their baby to full term. However, miscarriages and stillborn births are a possibility, and there's a disproportionate rate for black women who experience child loss at much uh, higher rates than white and Hispanic counterparts. And Shades of Becoming a Mom is stepping in to help support women who are grieving that process. Now, black babies in Indiana die at a rate of double the infant mortality rate experienced by white and Hispanic babies. And Saturday, Shades of Becoming a Mom tackled the issue of grief that mothers experience after infant loss. The group held its first candlelight ceremony in remembrance of the babies who have died before their first birthday. Now, there are a number of reasons why black babies aren't surviving and to shed more light, the organization is launching Black Baby Loss Week, which starts tomorrow. The nonprofit works to uh, alleviate cultural barriers experienced by black women during pregnancy, after delivery, and throughout the grieving process. To encourage moms to speak up and tell their truth, to access mental health resources if they need that as they're grieving that loss, and to also begin building partnerships with um, hospitals and healthcare workers to bridge that, that gap between the African American community and the medical community so that we can have a, a more trusting relationship. Now, there are plenty of other uh, supportive events that are happening. Uh, one on the calendar next year, Shades of Becoming a Mom will host its first community baby shower called Bump to Bundle. That event will help mothers and go over the warning signs uh, during pregnancy and what to look out if there are some uh, issues that a mother may be experiencing. And also, if she is experiencing uh, difficulties, techniques in order to advocate for herself by getting in touch with a primary care doctor or other resources sources um, to let someone know what she may be experiencing. But for now, what we'll do is just send it back to the newsroom reporting live downtown. Amisha Ramsey, Wish TV, wishtv.com and follow us on Facebook.